We started off by taking a small section of the picture and practicing some different techniques. We used sketching pencils, pastels, watercolors and charcoal. We all went to visit the National Gallery to see paintings and take part in a workshop. I really enjoyed the trip because the paintings were different types and different meanings. As well as that, I really liked the way we drew moustaches on our face like Henri Rousseau. Back at school, we looked at how different animals camouflage into the habitats, like the tiger in the Rousseau painting. We then looked at a type of art called lenticular art. Lenticular art is art that changes as the viewer moves around. The first examples were created by a painter called, called Bois Claire more than 300 years ago. We then looked at the work of a Belgian street artist called Roa. He has painted some huge murals of animals in different cities across the world, including some in our lo local area. Some of his works are examples of lenticular art. We decided to have a go at making our own lenticular artwork showing animals camouflaged in their habitats. First, the viewer just sees the animal's habitat, but as they move, the animal appears. They have the element of surprise, just like the title of Rousseau's painting. My favourite thing about the project was the way you didn't have to move the art to see the different side of it. You could just move yourself and the way the art just changed for you. My favourite thing was the meanings behind the paintings we saw in the gallery. I like the way that Henry Rousseau drew a tiger without ever seeing a tiger before and the way he imagined what it would look like. My favourite thing was that we started off with one painting but then there was like loads of different things at the end of it where everyone had different ideas. <laughs> 